we're off to breakfast and then we're going to Jules. <laughs> Waiting for the Uber. We made it, we survived. Our Uber driver is actually really nice and her son like called her and then tried to hit on us <laughs> and it was really funny. <laughs> amazing first off let me just say hands down incredible the production was so beautiful um the theater was gorgeous like they had this big chandelier with like um these like paintings all around it It was so so stunning um yeah it was just amazing and the dancers were great the costumes were beautiful um and yeah so I'm kind of kind of break down my thoughts on each section because this was my first time ever seeing Jules. Um, like I've seen like little clips of it, but never like an actual production of it. So anyways, first section was Emerald's. Emerald's costumes were really pretty. They had like this long romantic tutu that was green with like a green bodice with sparkles on it. And it was so pretty. And I love the, like the first Emerald's variation. Um, like I think the music is so pretty, especially in that section, it was really pretty. And it was just really good. It wasn't my favorite section, I'll just say that now. I mean, when I say that, it wasn't bad, it just wasn't my favorite section. Um, but yeah, it was really, really pretty. And the next session was Ruby's, and Ruby's is my favorite. <laughs> Hands down, it was so freaking good. It was the most balancing thing I've ever seen in my entire life, but I loved it. Like, they had, like, all of these really cool hip movements, and they had, like, these really cool runs. And at one point, like, um, there was a group of, like, four guys, and they, like, did this slide thing, and it, like, went over their toe and, like, went down on their, like, knee. It was so cool. Um, like, the leads were incredible. One girl did, like, three more than that she did way like so many like triple um pirouettes like just coming down and then she did two like double pique turns like parallel with her arms like here and it was so cool um ruby's like took my breath away and the costumes were so cool like it wasn't like a tutu or a skirt or anything it kind of just it was like a leotard bodice kind of thing and then it like cut off it was so 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 pretty um definitely my favorite section and i really liked the music it was very like upbeat and oh, it was just so cool to watch and the paw was really really cool and just getting to watch like the legs get whacked up there and stuff was so fun and then last was diamonds so diamonds is the most classical section it's definitely my second favorite um i had the costumes again were gorgeous like they were um white they were they were kind of off-white a little bit and they had like sparkles all on it and they had this like really pretty core section that was full of like a bunch of arabesques and stuff that was so pretty and then they had this really really long paw it was so good it was so so good yeah it was a lot more classical and it had like very much like the feeling of like third act wedding like everyone was there like at one point they had how many couples would you say it was like 20 couples I would say 20. it was like 20 couples like a guy and a girl walking out doing their whole little dance and then you also had like the principals it was insane like i've never seen that many dancers on stage nor have i seen that many male dancers in one space like that was crazy <laughs> like they just kept coming out and i was like where are they coming from but yeah it was really oh, it was incredible it was so so good so yeah, I highly recommend. I really enjoyed watching it. This was also my first time watching a Balanchine ballet, like, live. Like, I've seen videos and stuff, but 
this is my first time seeing it live and I thought it was really cool especially the ruby section I really like when they leaned heavily into the balancing stuff because like it's cool when like the balancing is thing is combined with classical but I really like it when they just kind of really lean into that like funky part and so that's why I like rubies that so much um but yeah it was really cool and I had just a great time it was a really fun day and yeah and by the way this is the merch that I got it's so comfy it was expensive but it was worth it and I got a ring pop because they were like jewels and I got one anyways um but yeah so thank you guys so much for watching i really appreciate all your support i'm almost at 400 subscribers last time i checked i might have hit 400 subscribers which is crazy so thank you guys for that and i'm at 14,000 views somehow on my day in a life and like 2,000 views on my week in a life which is absolutely insane so thank you guys so much for watching my stuff i really appreciate it um but yeah, let me know down in the comments what you want to see next. Um, hopefully coming up soon will be my tech week vlog and stuff like that because that's coming up so soon. Um, and yeah, I have a bunch of different ideas. There's going to be a lot more videos coming out later because I'm going to have like time and space and a lot more interesting stuff to do. Um, and sorry for no video last week. Um, I was going to vlog Halloween and then I completely forgot halfway through the day that I was going to. So, yeah, I only have, like, half of a vlog, and I figured, yeah, I might as well just not post something. So, I'm sorry for whoever was disappointed by that, but this video is going to be hopefully up on Tuesday. This will hopefully be a Tuesday that you're seeing it, because I don't have school on Tuesday. Um, but yeah, so lots of fun stuff coming up. I love you guys. Have an amazing day.